I'm getting my gown prepared for my doctor before her sterile surgery. I've selected a large sterile gown. It's got our indicator tape that has turned dark from the autoclave, indicating that it has been correctly sterilized. This gown is double wrapped, so I can open the initial first wrap without any contamination, and then I'll be more careful for my second sterile wrap. I've got my cap and uh, mask on, make sure I'm not contaminating, and I'm prepared for surgery and sterile. Alright, so I can remove my tape from my pack and then open each of my flaps on my pack. Opening away, I'm not reaching over my sterile field, but coming from the sides. And then this is my last one, coming away. And then inside is our actually sterile part of our pack. So I'm opening, pulling my flap and away from my field without reaching over top. I'm going to leave the last of my flaps for my sterile doctor to open. So she can come pull that one and then can get her, her towel and gown out. So I'm just going to step out of her way. And as she's putting that on, I'm making sure that I'm out of her way from her sterile field as she puts her gown on show my indicator strip that turns dark in the center of the line when it has been properly sterilized so I have verification that the gown is sterile. And then when my doctor's ready, I'm watching her sterile field, I'm her uh, monitor for surgical technique, and then I'm grabbing the straps of the gown, grabbing the straps of the gown without reaching into the front of it, I'm just touching the straps and the inside of the gown, not the outside. And I can work that up on over the shoulders and then tie in the back. start with the top one, get it on the shoulders, and then come down to the bottom, and I do the same, and I grab just the strap of the gown and pull it around to meet. Alright, and then I'm maintaining that my doctor has enough room on all sides so she's not contaminating her sterile gown in any areas, and then we are ready to go in for surgery.